hi guys welcome or welcome back to my youtube channel thank you so much for clicking if you're new here i am cherono and i'm a kenyan living and studying in the philippines and now right here in africa coming to you live from my village here in kenya okay so guys today i just want to show you a very simple procedure but it is tricky okay so today guys uh we are <sighs> For us here in Africa, here in the village, actually, my mom doesn't like to use, uh, we like to use, to drink fermented porridge, okay? But then, we don't like to buy. My mom doesn't want to go and buy, so she prepares her own porridge, her own sour porridge at home. The, the, the flour, that, that is. So, guys, I wanted to show you the process of uh, making it. Okay, I came home and she had already started it, so I'm just, just, I'm just continuing it, okay? So, the, the... The flour is already sour and now we have to dry it because if we leave it like that it's going to spoil so i want to sun dry them and i want to show you the process of sun drying them okay so guys uh without wasting more of your time please let us do this so guys <laughs> this is porridge so they are going to dry it like this i don't know i couldn't have showed you the process of of uh, fermenting it so this is fermented porridge my mom likes to ferment a porridge because my dad likes uh fermented porridge so now she's just uh drying them and now she has to separate them for them to try to dry real quick see so this is fermented porridge so it's going to be to to dry in the sun which sun dried them it's always uh fermented and then sun dried so according to to the, the test how you like it it can be fermented for a month a week two weeks see and then you can dry them so depending on how fermented you want it how sour you want it so this 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 porridge is going to be sour and my mom makes her own at home she doesn't buy it in the supermarkets and stuff like that she just makes her own at home so this one is fermented already and dried so this is the process of drying it so you just separate them like this so if you can see i don't know if you can see it in the camera but this thing is a bit uh wet not wet it's uh dumpy or something like that so and then she's just going to secure the because the wind can blow it away so she's securing with some firewood, the clean ones, of course. And you see the way she's doing it. So that's how you separate them. So the reason why they separate them is so that they dry. If they dry without being separated, they will remain like that. Okay, that's why they separate it. And then, ma'am, Cindy. So you see, so the reason why they are separating it like this because if you leave it like this, it will dry it like that. So and for my mom, she wanted to be flower. So that's why she's separating them. That way, when you just, I think I'll just get to show you when it is fully dried. So, guys, the goal here is to get a smooth consistency. If you can come close, come close, show them. See, there's some rough things. There's rough things. So, I'm trying to get it to very smooth like this. So, that's why I'm doing this. So, this actually, this is always an all day thing. Like in Sandra, you see those ones have already made them. So, I'm trying to separate them to create a smooth consistency that way it's easy when you're cooking porridge because if I let it dry like this it will dry it like that 
so that's why i'm doing that and guys this is normally done this is normally done on a sunny day because we are sun drying it okay it has to be very very dry because if we leave it like this it's going to spoil so it has to be very dry and then now you store it in a container and cook porridge so this is me trying to just get a smooth consistency so guys this one is actually a flour mixture of uh, of millet sorghum and some and some corn but not the, the normal kind the white kind the the pink when you put it aside to dry follow the madam Precious. If you know how to drink it, you will also know how to make it. Of course. You can't only be drinking, drinking every time you are just drinking. Actually, guys, I'll carry some of this to the Philippines. That's why I'm giving it a lot of efforts because I'll, I want to share it with my some of my friends who drink sour porridge <laughs> sometimes I wish my mom could be selling these things you know she's making them and she does it she only drinks them see this is organic you sun dry them and you just store them and it's going to you can you can as of long as it's very dry it can sit up to one year see these things no, no preservatives, no nothing. So Very smooth. 
very smooth. Okay, so now let's put it aside. Want to dry well? <laughs> This is ready. This is ready now. I just have to dry them like that. Spread them like that. So they can get enough sunlight. sun has moved so the trick is we move with the sun okay so this, this place is already I think the sun is in the clouds right now but then this place is already so cloudy so I'm going to move them to the sun okay I'm just going to move them where there is the sun So guys uh that's it for this vlog okay as you can see i'm already very dead dirty because of these things show them so i'll keep <laughs> yeah <laughs> yeah so i'll just keep moving them please okay. i'll just keep moving them to the sunlight and then when the sunlight is gone i will I will bring them to the house and then tomorrow morning we will start again okay so you guys uh I think I will just show you a video when the things when this uh, flower is already very dried okay so anyhow uh, thank you so much for watching guys remember to like the video also remember to subscribe and turn on the notification bells so that you don't miss out on any of my new videos and guys we are on the road to 20,000 subscribers so please subscribe and if you could share this video to your family and friends i'll really appreciate it okay so anyhow until next time i'll see you okay.